Now let's have blessings tree. Ito po yung set tree ng chemical, again, chemical, pag, si chemistry. Okay? Chemistry. 51. One of the components of gasoline is the hydrocarbon named heptane. Okay, meron tayong heptane. C7H16. What is the balance equation for its complete combustion? So, ang hinahanap natin is complete combustion ni C7H16. So, ano pala ang full equation nito? Okay, ang full equation nito is C7H16 plus O2 to carbon dioxide plus water. Okay, so paano ito? All we need is to balance the equation. And pag binalance natin ito, meron tayong C7 dito sa left side, dapat magiging... 7 din ito sa right side, si CO2. Saan dito? O, tama ba? Okay. O, tama. 7, 7 dito. So, saan choices dito ang may 7 na CO2? Hindi si A, hindi si C, at hindi si D. So, ang sagot natin is letter B. Okay, yun lang. If you can find the answer directly na wala po sa choices, huwag nyo nang isolve completely. Sagutin nyo na agad. So, 51 is letter B. Yan po yung balance equation po sa complete combustion ni heptane. Si hep, hep, hooray. 52. Which of the following is the correct set of properties of base? Okay? Properties of base ang hinahanap natin. ba? Kapag base, slippery. Kapag base, red to blue. Kapag base, medyo bitter siya. So, ang sagot natin is Charlie. 53. When a solution of an acid and a base are mixed together, so, minix natin si acid at base, ano ang yield output niya? Okay? Siyempre, it will have salt and water, it will lose their acidity and base kasi magiging neutral sila, at siyempre, it will, the both of them are neutralized. So, ang, sa, ang sagot natin dito is delta. All of the above are correct. Okay? Paboritong sagot natin, all of the above. Pero, careful again. Be careful. 54. In a redox reaction, reduction is defined as what? ba From Liora and Jiroa, yung reduction po sa redox reaction ay gaining of electrons by an atom. Alpha. 55. How many sodium atoms are in two moles of sodium? Okay? Ilan daw sodium atoms ang nasa two moles of sodium? Okay, paano ito, sir? Siyempre, we we are we are we will use Avogadro's number to find the grams uh the sodium atoms dito. So, paano? 2 moles of Na times 6.02 times 10 to the 23 units over 1 mole. Ito po yung constant po ha. So, 6 times 2 magiging 12. Sino dito ang 12 dito? Siyempre, 1.20 times 10 to the 24. 56. What is the molarity when 0.5 moles of HCl is dissolved in 250 ml of water? Okay. Uh, we are finding molarity po na meron tayong given na 0.5 moles at saka 250 ml. So, all we have to do is to divide 0.5 mole of HCl over 0.25 liters of hyd uh, not hydro, water po, H2O. So, ang sagot natin is 0.5 divided by 0.25 magiging 2.0 M. 2.0 M. 57. How many liters of propane gas are needed to produce 16 liters of water vapor? So, given po si equation. Okay, paano po isolve ito? Ito lang po yun. So, meron tayong C3H8 plus 5O2 2, 3, 2, 3CO2 plus 4H2O. Meron tayong given na 1 liter of C3H8 8 is to 4 liters of H2O. Saan galing po ito? Siyempre, dito sa C3H8 at saka 4 liters of H2O. ba yung product. Meron tayong hin hinanap natin is yung liters of C3H8 if we have 16 liters of water vapor. Okay, 16. So, 1, 4, X16. Siyempre, manipulating, ratio and proportion, 1 fourth is equivalent to X over 16. Anong lalabas po natin dito? Criss-cross again, 16 equals to 4x, magiging x equals to 4 liters, which is Charlie po. Okay, which is Charlie. Ganyan lang pag-solve, basic na basic lang po talaga. 58. Pero hopefully, walang sol problem solving po ni, uh, ano po, ni 
chemistry kasi based on enhanced TOS uh, focus lang po siya sa, yung sa in or focus lang po sa states of matter at saka sa mixture okay walang stoichiometry stoich stoich walang stoich po doon so hopefully wala lalabas na problem solving pero pinakita ko lang po kung paano just in case po na may lalabas just to be safe po basic lang naman 59 ay 58 pala which of the following is an organic compound so saan dito ay isang organic compound kapag organic compound mayroong carbon atom sino may carbon atom dito si glucose po glucose di ba si 6H12O6 the rest is not do not have an organic compound hindi po sila organic compound 59 the number of covalent bonds each carbon atom has in organic compounds is usually Okay, is usually what? Merong apat po. Okay, merong apat kapag carbon atom. Okay, apat na covalent band pag si carbon. Si, merong apat po siya. 60. An alkane with four carbon atoms would have how many hydrogen atoms in each molecule? Ang sagot po dito si 8. Paano po? Ito lang po yung formula dyan. Pag alkane. Pag alkane po, plus 2. So, meron tayong apat, 4 4 times and 4 times 2, 8. Tama ba? Okay, alkane with 4 carbon atoms would have how many hydrogen atoms in each molecule? So, 4, tsaka 4, 8, dapat 10 ito. Wait lang po ha. Recheck ko muna. Okay po, um, dito po, may mali po ako sa pag-highlight pag na sagot. So, Again po, meron tayong apat na carbon atoms at saka alkane. Di ba? Butane po ito. So, si butane, C4, H4 times N, 4 times 2 plus 2. 4 times 2, 8 plus 2. So, dapat letter C po. Okay? 10 po. 10 po, hindi po eh. Sorry po, nagkamali po ako ng pag-highlight. Pasensya na po. So, we have 61. A petroleum product that is composed of hydrocarbons with... with 12 to 15 carbon atoms per molecule is what? Ano po? Kapag 12 to 15. Pag 12 to 15 po, ang sagot natin is kerosene. Kaya ang sagot natin is kerosene. 62. The group CH3 is called what? So anong functional group po ito? Pag CH3, pag CH3 po, methyl. Okay? Methyl. CH3. 63. Compounds with the same molecular formulas but with different structures are called what? So, anong tawag natin sa mga compounds na pareho po yung molecular formula pero uh, iba po yung structural pattern nila. Ang tawag po natin dito is isomers. Isomers po sila. 64. Which of the following has a general formula of CNH2N? Okay, CNH2N. Kapag ganyang formula po ang ginagamit natin para kay alkin okay para kay alkin sixty five an alkyne with four carbon atoms would have how many hydrogen atoms in each molecule okay ilan po ito anong formula natin yung alkane plus two si alkyne naman minus two so cnh two n minus two meron tayong apat Apat, 4 times 2, equals to 8, minus 2, magiging 6. Okay, 6 po ang sagot. 66. No two electrons in the same atom can have the same four quantum numbers according to what? So, anong rule or principle po ito? Pag walang uh, dalawang electrons in the same atom na pwede sa isang, uh, on the same four quantum numbers, ang tinatawag po natin dito is si police exclusion principle, Charlie. Okay, Charlie. Let's have the next number. Okay, 67. Okay, paulit na po ito. Na-double ko. Okay, 67. Again, no two electrons. Police exclusion principle. Okay, 68. In beta emission, which statement is correct? Okay, sa beta emission, we are talking about beta emission. Pag beta emission po, guys, atomic number increases. Okay, na-increase po yung atomic number kasi pag atomic mass, nag-remain the same siya. 
di ba? So therefore, beta emission, atomic number lang yung nag-change. It will increase po kapag beta emission. 69. In which of the following states does a hydrogen electron have the greatest energy? Okay, medyo, medyo nakakalito po ito ha. Pag greatest energy, ang isasagot natin is 5. Okay? Pero by calculating po, ang, ang mas malaki po is si 7.5. Kaso lang, it is worth noting po, please remember, please take note of this, na in this state, kapag 7.5, hindi po siya, uh, yung state na ito is not physically possible. Kasi dapat, yung energy level are being quantized and can only have an integer value. So, hindi pwede si 7.5. So, that, ang sagot natin dapat is n equals to 5. Okay? n equals to 5. Remember po ha, pag quantized, dapat integer po siya. Hindi po siya 7.5 or any po na fraction. 70. What is the appropriate procedure to decrease the heat output of a fission reactor reactor core during a crisis? So, anong dapat gagawin natin para ma-decrease po yung heat? Okay? The only process For us to decrease the heat of a reaction core is to insert the control rods further. Okay? Yan lang po yung way po dito. 71. Oxidation can be defined as which of the following? Diba? Liora Jerowa again. Oxidation. Kanina, reduction. Ngayon, oxidation. Pag oxidation, loss of electrons. Loss of electrons, Charlie. 72. Which of the following alkene hydrocarbons and corresponding hydrocarbon groups? Okay, sino po dito ang alkene hydrocarbons? Di ba? Ang sagot natin is, bravo, CH3, CH2. 73. What is the formula weight of acetic acid? Okay, CH3, COOH, which is nandyan po kay vinegar. Okay, ano po ang formula weight niya? Remember, you should know the chons po. Dapat alam nyo po yung atomic uh, mass po ng chon. So, C-H-O-N at saka S. So, we have the following. To solve this, we need to have the given information. We have C-H at saka O. Si C, merong 12. Si H, merong 1. At si O, merong 16. So, 242, manipulating yung formula weight natin is 24.02 plus 4.04 plus 32. It will yield 60U. Okay, 60U po kay acetic acid. 74. What is the formula weight of magnesium hydroxide? That is an ingredient po that na makikita natin sa mga antacid. Okay? We are talking more about magnesium hydroxide. Anong formula po niya? Ang formula po niya is MJOH2. Okay? So ano ang atomic weight ni magnesium? 24.31, 16 kay oxygen, at 1 po kay hydrogen. So, input natin yung formula weight, atomic weight na tatlo, we will have 24.31 plus 16 times 2 plus 1 times 2. We will have, it will yield 58.38U, which is letter B, bravo. Last number, what is the correct formula of the product when lithium and sulfur react to produce lithium sulfide? Okay, saan dito si lithium sulfide? Lithium sulfide is Li2S. Siyempre, S2 negative po siya. So, crisscross Li plus Li2S. So, tapos na tayo sa set 3. Okay? Uh, move on na tayo sa next set po. Set 4 po. On the next video. See you there.